fireman, a social worker, and a hairdresser all have in common. They all work in the human services field, which consists of having strong people skills, the ability to work with others, and they all help someone. Our next educational stop was a swan. Hi. College wasn't a right fit for me. I went to college. I sat in class. I ADD'd out. Ah, a bird, a butterfly. So I knew it, I couldn't make it through four years. Our next plan to go see the financial planner. So a lot of people will talk about retirement or they'll talk about college or they'll talk about a new car, they'll talk about a new house, but they don't know how to figure out how to get that. So they don't sit there and put the numbers to it and come up with a plan and all of that stuff to actually do it. So most of us just make money and spend it and do what we want, but we have all these things we want, but we don't really know what we do in order to get them. And so my job is to help people or to figure out how to get them and to make people do what they want to do. So, social, so you went on over to a social worker. Social workers are people who typically study those things and understand how they work to know what direction do we go in. Do we need to get CPS involved because the parents are actively harming the child or they're passively harming the child because they're not taking care of them? Or is this a situation where we just need to hook these parents up with some resources so they can afford some food? There wasn't a buy up, but we called the buy station and asked them to see if we could interview Chief Stanford. Um, like, how many hours you work, the environment, what do you work? Okay. When you're a firefighter on the floor, you work 24-hour shifts. So that means you come to work, you have to be here by 7 o'clock, and you don't get off till 7 o'clock the next day. Don't worry, no one was hurt, but next we went to go see Nurse Rodriguez. I knew when I started nursing, I knew that, well, I've always wanted a big family, so I knew that my would have to fit with that. So school nursing was always my goal, but it just took too long. And next, we went shopping at the boutique to ask Lana how she liked owning her own business. For a business owner that has a brick and mortar, which is my building, I've got a you know storefront. Um, versus somebody that's just going to sell online, they don't have to pay. They don't have to pay their rent, they don't have to pay their mortgage, they don't have to pay payroll, they don't have to do payroll taxes. All they have to do is put a cute top on and sell it off of them and then ship it.